And we now visit New Year's celebrations elsewhere in Malaysia, where Chinese make up almost a quarter of the country's 30 million population. And we meet a craftsman who has been making line hats for over 30 years. The lion dance, usually performed to get rid of evil spirits and garner good luck, has a long history dating back to China's first major dynasty, the Han. Some of the auspicious rituals include touching the lion's head for good luck and giving red packets to the troop. Most of the lion performers are from martial arts schools, adding to the spectacle with acrobatic kicks and jumps. The lion's head itself is the work of a master craftsman, Xiu Ho Fiu. Now aged 61, he started making lion heads himself more than three decades ago due to pricing considerations and a lack of trade between Malaysia and China at the time. At the start, I only made lion heads for my own troop. Then friends and other troops started asking if I could make one for them. I said, OK, I'll try. After two or three, I realized I could open a workshop. And here I am, making a local product. The process consists of three basic steps. Making a frame, applying a papier-mâché cover, and finally coloring the head to define the personality of the lion according to the client's taste. This lion dance is a culture. It's not new. It dates back thousands of years, and still there's many more to go. I think that as long as it remains a beautiful art form, there will be those who will carry it on. We are not worried. Chinese New Year, the Year of the Monkey, starts on Monday the 8th of February. Abdiel Leroy, CCTV.